My collection for Fairfield is all encompassing. It's a dining room, it's occasional, it's upholstery. It's also the first time they've introduced bedroom. So it just seemed like a great time to do it since I was introducing the collection. I'm excited too for people to see it's a combination of different styles. There are traditional pieces, transitional pieces, and pieces that also can lean sort of in a more contemporary aesthetic. I'm not trying to be everything to everybody, but I want them to see that these pieces can be used in different ways, in different styles, to create various looks. The partnership with Fairfield started a year ago in October. They had a With It event at their old showroom. And I just kind of took a second look at everything and I thought, wow, this is really beautiful. It was a totally different aesthetic from what I knew Fairfield chair to be. I met Dixon Mitchell, the president, and I loved the way they were taking the direction of the company. And here we are. A lot of the furniture is made of quartered ash and walnut and so we started playing with some different finishes. There's a beautiful modern truffle that's got a real warmth to it, but still has gray undertones. There's another one called Sheer Dove, which is a beautiful gray that almost has a little putty in it. And then there's a rich one called Dark Sable. It's got black undertones, it's very rich. And there's another beautiful one called Ceruse Espresso. It's a beautiful dark finish, but it's almost got a little whitewash in the grain of the wood, so you really get credit for the grain of the wood and it adds some dimension for sure. I have a lot of clients that are really worried about mixing metals. They're afraid they can't mix silver and brass in the same room. So I developed a custom finish for my collection called Champagne, and it's beautiful. It's got silver undertones, but it's still got sort of warmth and a little hint of that gold to it. It plays beautifully with both silver and brass, and so I think it kind of answers that call, and I'm giving people permission to mix metal finishes. And when I knew Fairfield was getting into motion, I was really focused on wanting to create a beautiful recliner that you couldn't tell it was a recliner. And what's been so much fun is so many people have walked by it, they have absolutely no idea it's a recliner. So I did my job. Fairfield Chair Company is 98 years old. We'll celebrate our centennial in 2021. And we've never been stronger than we are now, as you can see from our designs. With Libby's easy, elegant, everyday style, she has really captured the essence of a breath of offerings. But one of my favorite pieces is behind us is the daring sectional. I think it's so comfortable, it's so unique, uh, just beautiful. And also behind us is the Wesley Etagere, the mix of materials with the glass, the brushed brass, the beautiful ceruse oak finish. I mean, wow. Part of the fun of partnering with a company like Fairfield was finding holes in the items that they were already offering. They're such an established company. They've been in business for almost 100 years. So I think what I was able to bring to the collection was a softness and a little bit of a finessing of arms on chairs, curves on benches, things that are well proportioned, but super, super comfortable. 